Hey everybody, how you doing out there? It's yours truly, Dave, and I'm doing a podcast. I, I do the stereo podcast. A stereo podcast. Not a model sounding podcast. A stereo one. But no, nonetheless, you're here in Dave's world. This is Dave's world. Welcome to my world, right? Welcome to my world. In the podcast world. I just want to say that here I am doing a podcast for you guys to listen to on YouTube. That's right, on YouTube. That's right, that's where I am, on YouTube. No other social media. Anyway, let's get that out of the way. I want to talk about my dear friend, uh, Thunder Nams. I was, I'm thinking about him heavily, uh, very much these days. Um, may you rest in peace. Uh, uh, 2018, 2018 he passed away. Uh, July, July 2018 that he passed away. Uh, may you rest in peace forever and ever in eternity. I'm going to say it loosely. Eternity. Uh, you're up with the Lord. You're up with God or Jesus, wherever He is. Uh, you're with the Lord. You're with you're with the you're with the Father in the afterlife. The Father means God, Jesus, or the Lord of Lords, uh, our Lord and Savior, as people would say, describe it as in the Bible. Um, he's up there with the Lord. He's not in hell. You know where the depths of hell. Uh, he's not there. He's not there. I, I guarantee you he's not there. Uh, but yeah, my dear friend has passed away in July of 2018, uh, at the age, tender age of 45. Uh, it was very sad for a lot of people, uh, not just me, but a lot of other people he knew. The circle of friends, I call it the circle of friends. Uh, so yeah, he, he was well known in Troll and, uh, not just seeing me all the time, but a lot of other people he met along the way in his journey. Uh, uh, but yeah, he made a, he made, uh, he met a lot of people in his life, and I want to say rest in peace. I'll be there when I pass away. That won't be until I'm 100 years old. When I'm 100 years old, I'll pass away. Until then, I may not uh, may not be alive until then. I'm now in my uh, getting up to 50. I'll be there in the several decades, several several decades. And uh, I want to iterate, uh, may you rest in peace forever and ever, eternity. Hope God is there for you at the pearly gates. Uh, we scribe, we scribe uh, what heaven is all about, what heaven is, describes it as. You got the pearly gates, big pearly gates, God is going to wish you in there. Um, and I'm going to mention this heavily, heavily. Now the Bible speaks of the heaven and, and, and hell. Heaven and hell. There is such a thing as hell, but the hell we're talking about is uh, hell is when the, the Grim Reaper, that is hell. That will be hell for all you people who go to hell. Uh, when, they, when they mean said go to hell, they really mean that, go to hell. Uh, there's a hell in the world. There's the heaven and there's hell. The Bible describes what hell means. The Bible describes what hell means. I mean, uh, no. Heaven means, sorry. Uh, and people have their stories of what heaven means to them or what hell means to them. Uh, hell means is you're going down to the dips of hell. You're going to all the way where uh, the hot, the hot, it's like, going to, it's like going to where hot lava is. That is where hell is. Uh, that's where hell people describe it as. It's like the Grim Reaper waiting for you at the door, at the uh, at the hell the gate, at the hell's gate. They call it hell's gate. Um, but my my dear friend who passed away so time ago, um, he's not there. He's not at hell gate. He's at heaven's gate right now. So rest in peace to eternity. Remember that word, eternity. Uh, he's gone uh, in this world. Uh, but he did many things. Uh, he did like um, let me let me describe it to you. It's like a bucket list. He did many things in this world to make him happy, to make him fulfill his his duties to to all things in life. Uh, he was a dear friend of mine of, of 31 years of friendship, but he's long gone in this world, and he, he's missed to uh, was very missed, very loved by his two girlfriends. Two young, beautiful women. Uh, I mentioned several times about them, uh, Chrissy Fisher and uh, and um, uh, Isabel. Yeah, Chrissy Fisher and uh, 
Isbell. Now, I don't know Isbell last name, but I do her know her first name. But anyway, I want to say that uh, he's gone in the afterlife. He's really gone in the afterlife. And the, the people that were there at the funeral, uh, there was Chinese descent. There were Chinese descent people. I want to raise my voice and really describe it as for you guys. Uh, it was Chinese descent, but uh, when I looked in the casket there, it was an open casket, him being in there. Uh, and uh, that's scary, a lot of people were there. And at the last minute, every, everybody was rushing to the casket, taking pictures of my dear friend, uh, who was rest in peace, who was rest forever and ever into the afterlife. Uh, until the afterlife, until he, uh, well, I don't want to say rot in hell, but just into eternity. It'd just to be a lot nicer uh, to eternity. So he's gone to eternity. He's uh, gone with the mother and the father in the afterlife. Uh, so from his mother, his real dad, his real mother, uh, passed away before him, um, and he's gone in 2018. And he had a he had a bad cold and he passed away the next day. Uh, so peacefully, no one shot him. No one, no one knifed him. He just passed away peacefully. And um, it was really sad. It was really sad for all of us hearing this. It really was. Uh, not just me, just a lot of people he knew. Um, I haven't heard from Chrissy for a long, long time. Ever since, ever since uh, my friend passed away. Uh, the day after he passed away, she phoned and uh, uh, I haven't heard from her since. Anyway, um, but Isabel, I keep in touch with her like a year ago after the uh, passing of my friend, but not as late. So folks, let me, let me just give you an iteration here, the, uh, the sentiment here. Uh, the sentiment is that uh, he was my friend for 31 years of friendship. And uh, he's long gone, and it was very sad for a lot of people, very long sad. And uh, he was very grateful. I kid you not, you were around him, you would, you would be how cheerful he was. Uh, he would, uh, his background was Native Indian, so he was Native Indian, so he was, uh, I forget now the uh, terminology. Uh, but yeah, he passed away at age 45, can you believe it, a young man, a very young man. And uh, I knew him personally, for, 30, uh, for 31 years, uh, I knew him personally. Uh, but a lot of people that he knew, uh, he made friends outside of outside of me, but that's okay, because it was, you know, uh, we were just friends for each other, we weren't, you know, married to each other, we're just friends, you know, just the word friends. Um, and, uh, yeah, 31 years is good friendship, good friendship. Yeah, in this world you have friends, in this world you have your girlfriends. Uh, the part in the world that you got to have are friends in your world, just in case anything were to happen in your world. Uh, so you got to have those friends, so uh, back it will keep you straight and narrow in life, in all walks of life. Uh, if you're, if you're, you know, Donald Trump to, uh, you know, Barack Obama to uh, uh, Joe Biden, you, you, they look up to you. They really look up to you. They don't think you're a failure as a person. Uh, and I mean that to every, I don't say that to everybody, but I just, I want to let you know that not everybody's a failure in this world. You know, God doesn't, uh, God doesn't say that any human being on this planet is not a failure, uh, as a human being. Uh, everybody rise to the occasion. They rise to the occasion. I've, I've seen so many people in my lifetime to know this. Uh, they have this uh, totem pole mentality. You know, either you die by the sword or you live by the sword. I just sound in stereo. This is stereo sounding podcast. And uh, this is right and left, so we'll come out the right and left speakers. And this is sounding not mono but stereo, so this is a stereo podcast. Uh, so if you want, if you guys want to do a podcast out there on YouTube, you could do this, just like me, like like I'm doing. Uh, you know, you don't need any tools; just need to find the right app to do it with, and you, you could do a podcast easily enough. So there you go, folks. It doesn't take any uh, any attributes. All you need is some know-how to do a podcast and really get it going. Uh, if you're in the, if you're ever into broadcasting, they'll teach you this stuff. Uh, 
how to do a broadcast, how to do a podcast. Uh, it, it goes both ways, folks. It really goes both ways. So this is my story of my dear friend of Thunder Nabs, who rest in peace forever and ever to eternity. The word you should use is eternity. Uh, that means he's gone with the Lord, the God of our world. And the Bible does mention that Jesus, the Lord of Lords. And uh, he's, he's waiting for a lot of people at the pearly gates. The pearly gates, that's where Jesus is. He's waiting for all of us to be there in unity. They call it unity. Uh, so we have, oh, by the way, by the way, there's angels. If you were to think about angels, there's such thing as, there's angels in this world. It's called archangels. These are angels, uh, be a, uh, not God, but God. angels are, have wings. These are real angels and the, uh, above the clouds. And they appear out of nowhere. These are archangels. A fallen angel, or people call them fallen angels. Uh, it's not to do with the humans, it has to do with angels above the sky or above the clouds. These are angels that have come and saved the humans. And these are real angels. These are real angels. And a lot of people use them. Uh, people will say them in a different way and a different meaning. Fallen angels are like, uh, angels are very fallen. Uh, and a lot of people do have angels in their lives. They're, they're soul seekers. They're soul seekers. And that's what they need to be called, soul seekers. Uh, they like to, they, 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 okay. they like to find souls. They like to find souls in their lives to achieve what they need, need to achieve. Uh, these are all humans of uh, creed or color, size, weight, and age, no matter what the age bracket is. You could do what you could do and you could raise your voice. Be a, a, be a voice to the voiceless. I'm always saying this to everybody. Be the voice to the voices. Let them have a voice to say, to say what they need, what they really want to say. We want to, we want to, we want to get these people with the voice to the voiceless in stereo. And that's what I mean. So guys, angels, believe in angels wholeheartedly that God, God mentions angels in the Bible. In the uh, King James version. And these are archangels. These are very much archangels. And uh, that's how they describe in the, the, uh, the Bible. Now, it doesn't matter what Bible you believe in. Hebrew Bible, the Hebrew. Or King James Version or the uh, original Bible. There's different versions of the Bible. Uh, different versions, different phrases they go with. Um, so, so remember, uh, I want to say that uh, if you believe in God, you're the righteous guy. You're the righteous guy. You're the righteous guy. You believe in God. Atheist means you don't believe in God. That's the word you should look up. It's called atheist. And uh, the people who don't believe in God, they're the unchristian people. So there you go, folks. If you believe in God, come with us. Come with us. You believe in God, come with us. We'll let you in your church. Okay? If, if you're an atheist, you don't believe in God, you believe there's some God out there, you're part of the, you're part of the, uh, uh, you're part of the solution, not the problem. And I mean this for everybody out there. You're part of the uh, solution, not the problem. Uh, so remember, this podcast is going to be in stereo, my stereo, and it'll be broadcast out to YouTube. And I want to, I'm, I'm so happy doing my podcast in stereo, not mono sound. And uh, I'll do a stereo mix. I'm going to do a stereo mix on this. Very much a stereo mix. <laughs> 